Good morning. It is Monday, July 5th. Ah, it's really nice out this morning. The temperature is perfect. It's about 5.35 in the morning. And I have a friend staying in from out of town. Good morning. You want to sleep or you want to get up? Libby's in there asleep. But we just tried to wake her. So we'll see if we have a guest for this morning's sunrise. What do you think, Trouble? She gonna make it? If it was me, I probably would roll back over and go to sleep. We had a good time last night with some friends. Fireworks, food, music. It was a good time. Community. All right. Let's go check out the sunrise. Look who made it. Hurry up, girl. Here comes the sun. Good. <laughs> oh, two adventures. Like future adventures like kayaking. We can pretend we're in Florida. <laughs> I was just thinking. Were you? <laughs> yes. <laughs> Sunrise though, so it's not Key West. Fort Lauderdale. <laughs> hmm. Yeah, the weather's beach weather today. Yeah. So, um, what beaches have you ever been to? You said you've not been to Tidy Island yet. Mm -mm. Mostly Florida. Dustin? Nope, haven't been there either. I've been wanting to go there. I've been to Fort Lauderdale. It was pretty. Um, Panama City. As they would say, PCB. Mm -hmm. Clearwater. So, yeah, not Miami Beach, though. I went there, mm -hmm. and the, like, the beaches were way too shallow. And they were, like, the surf was too rough. Yeah. Treasure Island, which, I mean, if you think about it, it's all the same beach. It's on the golf. Mm -hmm. Have you been out of the country to a beach? Like, have you, get, have you been to Mexico? Yes. On a cruise. Went to Jamaica, the Cayman Islands, and then Cosmo. Beautiful. You're actually wearing a shirt right now that says Cozumel, Mexico. Mm -hmm. I think that's what got this conversation started. Oh no, it was the sunrise. Mm -hmm. Looking like we were chilling on the beach. Yeah, I want to go to Cozumel too. And I want to do more snorkeling. Like that's my favorite. Maybe even scuba if I'm brave enough to take mm, lessons. You're brave. Not for me. I'm brave, but I don't know if I'm that brave. <laughs> I, can scoot I love just so in snorkeling, you know. I actually, have, one time, the very first time I ever went snorkeling, it was in Key Largo, close to Key West, Key Largo. And we went in, in you know, in a, a boat out in the middle of nowhere ocean. And I thought, oh, this is not going to go well. Because at seven years old, my dad took us to see Jaws, the whole family of seven, to, at seven years old. So, you know, I had nightmares of like Jaws and I couldn't hang my foot off the bed. Anyway, so we go to Key Largo and go snorkeling, and I'm like, oh no, this is going to be traumatic. I'm not going to enjoy this. 
we jump in the water, I stick my, my mask in the water and all of a sudden, have you done it before? Have you ever put your face in the clear blue water? Yeah, probably if you've probably. been to, okay. So anyway, you see all this fish. And seriously, in that instant, I was like, oh my gosh, I love this. I could swim to the end of that horizon. And like, I could just die swimming and snorkeling and I would be happy camper. <laughs> it was just so amazing. Felt like I was in the middle of a Jacques Cousteau show or something. <laughs> So if you were at the beach, um, you'd go running, and then how else would you spend your day at the beach? Laying out till about one, two-ish. Just probably catnapping a little bit. <laughs> Just nice. enjoying yeah. the sounds of the ocean. Mm -hmm. Kids playing. Yeah, the kids are over there building sandcastles. <laughs> Burying each other in the sand. That, and then people walking around with their little metal detectors. Oh, I want to try that. Uh, it's actually fun. Metal detecting? Yeah. You've been? Yeah. I've done metal detecting out in the yard, too. My grandma and grandpa used to metal detect for fun, and they would take us along to dig up the coins. Mm-hmm. It's interesting what you can find sometimes. Mm hmm or what it picks up. And it sounds like that chicken back there is having a hard time laying. <laughs> <laughs> I'm pretty sure that's a rooster, Libby. <laughs> yeah, he's gonna have a real hard time laying that egg. That was the rooster? It yes. sounds like the chicken. Oh my. Roosters are chickens. Well, I know, but it sounds like she's back here <sighs> trying to oh, lay her oh, egg. Oh, maybe. Huh? Maybe. Um, maybe. <laughs> oh, good morning. <laughs> I can actually feel the warmth of the sun. Mm. Can you? Mm -hmm. Yeah, a little bit. If you close your eyes, you could. Can you imagine the sand? Oh, beautiful. Oh, I've been deep sea fishing. Ooh, I would like to do that. Yeah. I mean, How even just to be that? on the boat and go out. I mean, yeah. honestly, I don't even care if I cast it. Yeah. But just to be there for the experience was a, was a lot of fun. I'd probably fall in the water. <laughs> Some of that stuff that comes out there is oh, huge. Yeah, you're bringing back the Jaws memories already. <laughs> da -da. <laughs> da -da. <sighs> How far do you like going into the ocean? Like if you're at the beach? Mm -hmm. The honest truth is that movie scarred me. Yeah. Like, I can do it, but I've, I've even, okay, so I prefer, like I said, I prefer sitting on the surf, mm -hmm. and so you're in this wet sand, and like the waves are washing up over you, and, and then my daughter and I, she's my beach buddy, and we would, you know, like play in the surf, and then so you're, this, the waves are crashing on you, and you're kind of riding them, and rolling over in the surf, I like that, so. Yeah, so walking out where the waist, it's waist deep and then a little higher than that, that's just not my thing. I'll do it, but you can't see under you. I might go waist deep. That's about it. Yeah. I'm good. Mm -hmm. I'm good. If I get a little too far, I'm being... I just... Yeah. <laughs> Keep it level, I guess. I don't know. I'm short, so... But sometime when you come back to the area, we need to definitely go kayaking. Yes. Because that's the thing here. People, they kayak down the Duck River. Actually. Or tubing. Yeah, it's right there. Right, right, like, less than a mile that way. Actually, I need to go check it out. I wonder if they got a brochure down there. It doesn't have to be next time. It could be this trip. Hey. Seize the moment. I'm all in. All right. Y'all locals? Anybody locals listening? 
<laughs> we going kayaking or tubing. Come on down. Yes, that would be fun. Ooh, you know Life is an adventure. Yeah. Too bad you couldn't get up at the same time in the morning on a kayak <gasps> and film the sunrise. This is not a waterproof camera, but you're right. Oh, shoot. But you're right. Why do we have to have the sunrise here at this farm? It could be on location sunrise in Tybee Island. Oh, hey. <laughs> <laughs> Road trip. Yeah. No, really, like it. Yeah, that's a good idea. Or at least walking down the lane. Mm hmm. You know, all kinds of stuff. In the neighborhood, just go find, go find a little different spot. Okay, do you have any deep thoughts for us today, Libby? Well, I don't know if my deep thought thinking cap's on right now. I'm just enjoying the moment and the beauty. Wait, that's it. Enjoy the moment. Enjoy the beauty around you. Mm -hmm. And the rooster agrees. tomorrow. Just got my nose on the last one. Okay. Okay. You, <laughs> now you gotta look right in there. Oh. Have a good day. See you tomorrow. See ya. No, you, you gotta move it to the sky. Oh. You getting it? I got short arms. Bye! See you tomorrow. <laughs> is, is, that, totally is that the sky? The sky. <laughs> it might be with me, me being so short. <laughs> oh my gosh. This is and that's a wrap.